y'all it's your girl Candice Denise and I'm back again with another video another video mm. what's up y'all what's good what's popping it's your girl as I've already said because I said it already but anywho I hope everyone's doing good safe sanitizing you know loving on your family friends and just living and experiencing all that life has to offer as you can tell from the title, we have a haul from Lovely Wholesale. Another plus size clothing haul, y'all. And I'm all about adding the fashionable pieces to the wardrobe. And Lovely Wholesale is not playing with you guys, okay? They are not playing at all. And so they have, you know, cute fashionable pieces at a lower cost. Definitely have to make sure to bring you the deals and the cute stuff so you can be baddest for the low. Period. So most of the stuff that I got is in a size 5X, I want to say. I'll put the size of the items below as I try them on. Um, Normally, I'm a size 3X, so I size them. But what I recommend is that you take your measurements. So that way, when you find something that you like, you can always use the measurements and compare them to yours and pick the right size. Because I know a lot of times people say they struggle with what size to choose. Well, I'm just putting y'all on game. Take your measurements. Do your sizes that way. But normally, I size up two sizes for my normal size. So, and let's just go ahead and get started, y'all. Okay. It's giving business in the front and party in the back. Because, okay, so let me show you everything else before I show you the back. So, it's a crop top with the elastic here. And there's like a little peephole, peekaboo, going on right there. Drawstring, and it does have a little hoodie on it. Uh, it's plenty of room, plenty of stretch, plenty of give. Um, the skirt, pretty much the same, stretchy, elastic at the waist. There was a drawstring here, but um, I lost it on the way up. Um, it does have the illusion of a pocket. These aren't pockets. Um, I really, really love this outfit because it's cute, but it's hugging in all the right places. It's comfortable, but the only thing I can't get with is this split in the back, and I'm going to have to, uh, and excuse the undergarments as well. You probably can see the flowers and the daisies, but this split go up way too high. Yeah, I can feel my booty back there. I can feel a little breeze going through the split. So I would just probably have to sew up the split just a little bit. Um, I would have just turned it to the side, but with these uh, pockets, illusions here, it ain't gonna look right turned to the side. But yeah, all I gotta do is just sew it up just a couple stitches and this will be perfect. I can just wear this with some boots or some sneakers if i want like i got some gray and white ones that'll go cute with this but overall i really like this one like i said it's comfortable but the fit of it adds that piece of sexiness and you know sensuality to it like i want to be comfortable but i'm a lady <laughs> what y'all think about this one would y'all keep it split or would you sew that guy up let me know in the comments Ooh. Okay, so we got a little high-low action going on here. Um, I wouldn't say this is a floral print. It's more of a, like, tie-dye-esque. Give me 70s vibes. It's got, like, a pink, red, purple, black, white, green, forest green, lime green, light pink. It's got, like, all the colors kind of mixed in, but to me, it's not too, 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 too much. It's not too much. And it does have the little strings at the bottom so where you can draw it in, I guess. That's how it would look. Yeah, I need mine to be a little more. Yeah, like that. But I love this combination of colors. It's super stretchy. You got plenty, plenty of room because it has that balloon effect going on. It does have a collar. The 
the back has that same little pattern going. It's like a psychedelic type thing going on. But overall, this is really cute. I have just the boots to go with this. And it's gonna be a look. Oh my God, I can see it already. I can see it. Oh, this gonna be a look, y'all. I got some green knee boots. Same color as in these, this dress. <sighs> but what do y'all think about this one? Would you wear it? I know it's kind of busy. Some people may be afraid of it because it's a lot of color, but it's not for me, it's not a lot of color. Color, it's just right. And it's subtle. Now, if it was like bright neon colors, then it may be a bit much, but like these subtle colors are just everything. I'm in love. What y'all think? What y'all opinion? Okay, this is giving naughty Wednesday Adams. Um, the boobs are too small. Yeah, I could. Ooh, I'm I'm not even gonna try to button that, hun. Concept was cute, like adding some tights and maybe some sneakers or something to this would be cute like some sheer tights or stockings or something maybe like even some doc martens with the thick heel on them to give the whole goth street look i like it but it, it is definitely too short for me to do anything in I, yeah but it's stretchy, but it's not enough stretch to give me enough room to be able to fit up here. Um, there's no buckle on the sleeve. There's no give. Not a lot of give at all. Like, I'm tucked in tight in this thing, honey. It has a little collar on it. Let me show you the back. I hope that I don't expose myself. Yeah, it's cute in concept and theory, but maybe if the wagon wasn't there, it'd be a little longer. And if the stomach wasn't there, it'd be a little longer in the front, too. So, if you don't have as much stomach and not enough butt, it'll fall just right, right where it needs to be. But these boobies, this gut, and this butt ain't letting it happen. But I like it, though. It's really cute for around the house for me. But for somebody else, y'all can, you know, step back. But yeah, if I was to wear this, then it would definitely have to be like some sheer tights and some really cute shoes. But overall, I like it though. It's really cute. Wednesday, Adam. How she used to do it? Happy Turkey Day. <laughs> Come on, yellow sunshine. Cute little three-piece number or whatever. Um, I don't have on the right bra for this. Like, I wonder if I could wear this without a bra. It's not really doing anything at the bottom to cinch it in, but it's definitely worth a try. Mmm. But, um, it's a cute little three pieces of spaghetti scrap, spaghetti strap, crop top. Then you have the pants, and the pants actually do. I do the ruching at the ankle. So, because everybody know I got these little drummy. So, normally the pants are too big at the bottom. But they actually fit at the bottom. They're a little long. Probably like an inch or two. And I'm 5'6 ish. So, I got an extra inch or two of pants at the bottom. Now, there is elastic at the waist. There's a string here, but it's not drawstring. So, I feel like I keep pulling at it. But. And then you have the the cardigan kimono thing. All of it is very, very, very stretchy. Um, I would even like, you can wear this out just like this. If you don't feel comfortable with the crop top, you can always add a shirt to it and then a cute sneaker, cute heel with pop of color. Don't be afraid to do a pop of color. Even if it is yellow, 
you can still add a pop of color to it to set it off. But I really like this three-piece number. It's comfortable. And I love how it's uh, fitted at the ankle. I would even wear this to work with a shirt. Like maybe a white shirt tucked in. And then wear this in some my Ben and Jerry's. That'll be real cute. Real, real cute. But I love this little yellow number. Yellow is one of my colors. What do y'all think? Oh, I forgot to tell y'all, it does have pockets. It got pockets. It got pockets. Well, let me show you what it looks like without. Mind you, I do not have on the right undergarments. So you'll be able to see straight through. But this is what it looks like in the back. <sighs> so you can always wear it without the kimono as well, whichever you prefer. So like if you wear it like outside to a cookout in the summertime, you can take the cardigan off and just put it around your waist if you want to. So this outfit has a lot of flexibility and versatility, which I love. It's giving, it's just giving like, you got the cream color here. You got the caramel brown color all up and through. So let's just get into it. This number, it does stretch. It's V-neck, of course. It has a collar around the caramel color collar. It has the slits on the side. It's not... The slits are not too deep to make you feel uncomfortable. Like it's giving just enough thigh. You're giving what needs to be gave right here. It's got the, the stripes all up and through. You're just getting cream on the back. But this is really cute, y'all. It's like giving me a retro vibe. And then especially with this color here, I'm, I'm getting a lot of retro vibes. It is knee length, long sleeves, but you can, of course, adjust if need be. Whew. Like the wheels are just turning with this one. What do y'all think? Y'all like it? Is it giving? Oh, wait, <clears throat> I'm gonna put a little bass in it. Wow. <coughs> okay, that's as good as it's gonna get. <laughs> but check out the dress. So we got this leopard print, cheetah print. Whichever print you want to, you know, go with. So, it has the little taper effect in the middle, but it doesn't button or anything like that. There's no buttons. It's a cotton-like material, so it's really, really stretchy. You would, of course, have to wear a strapless bra. I just pulled mine, you know, to the side for the sake of today. Um, It does go off the shoulder. It is midi length. Get into it. Catch the bag. But it does have this ruching effect in the front. As you can see, the strings, you can, you know, give them a little ba 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 boom Create some ruching here. Or you can just let it go. Whichever one, you know, you want to go with. Either works for me. Um, The sleeves are super, super long, though. I have short arms, so I can't say if they're long or if it's just my arms are short. But the leaves are leaves. The sleeves are really long, but you can always pull them up. I wish they were shorter so that I can have that, that cowbell effect at the end. But, yeah, I have to pull it up, so. 
because they are entirely too long. But I love this dress, y'all. What do you think about this one? Like, you can add jacket. I see a leather jacket and some boots. Or wait till the um, springtime, summertime come. Add some sandals to it. <sighs> I'm in love with cheetah girls, cheetah sisters. Uh, stripes are, wait, stripes are different. Cheetah, so cheetah is stripes. So this is leopard print. I have to check into that. All right, now we have come to the end of the video, guys. Did you enjoy the haul? What were your favorites? What were the pieces that you liked the most? Let me know down in the comments. Like, I pretty much was feeling everything. Some I like more than others, but I really was pretty much feeling everything. So, let me know what y'all think. And what I'll make sure to do, of course... It's with the sizes in the video so you can see what size everything is. In the description box, there will also be the links directly to each item. It will be the sizes of each item. My measurements are in there too. And there's going to be a coupon code so y'all can save some money on your order. New year, new you. Step your wardrobe game up, y'all. Y'all, we supposed to be stepping this year, so I need y'all to go on step. I do want to thank you guys so much for watching. Thank you for your love and thank you for your support. And if no one else has told you that they loved you, just know that Kenneth and Nisa does love you. And I will see you guys in the next 